everyone and welcome back to my channel my name is amy from new here and today i am in sunny lanzarote and we are going to a boot sale um my old manager at sense used to live here and she said this goes to a good boot sale so we're gonna have a little mooch about and i'm very excited <laughs> Blazers, which are cute, but a bit bulky. I would like something a little bit warmer. <gasps> that shirt's quite fun. If that was long sleeve, I quite like the orange. Love these pumps. Love this blazer, but it's gonna be too small, annoyingly. But it's Amy Green. This denim waistcoat gilet sort of thing. Um, but they can be a tiny bit too big. So quite fun. I'm just looking for cruise campo glasses. This pinstripe blazer, but as you guys know, I want the whole, the whole suit. This is also quite cute. This skirt is so cute, but as you guys know, I don't wear short skirts, and also it's tiny. Our top is also really cute, but again, it's small. Got some coins. Oh, I've made my three purchases. Um, I'm going to put them as well. Just made another purchase. Also, this is the bag from the supermarket. Yes, it's plastic. Um, I'm sorry, everybody. Little yellow sweater vest, which is cute. This is cute as well, but I'm not sure if it's going to be too small. Hello everyone, I'm back from Boots Out. Apologies for such the weirdest angle ever, but I thought I'd show you what I got. But before that, I'm going to show you what my dad got. Well, this is the haul I've got from the boot sale. I like a particular brand of beer, which you can't really get in England, and memorabilia is so expensive. On this stall, I purchased four items, two tankards, two smaller ones with full colour, laughing fat man as I call him, and also a beaker, which was given to me free as I was leaving the stall and the chat found beneath the um, table. So very helpful and a very positive experience. How well. much were each glass? Good question. Each glass was one euro, yeah. but I was given the beaker gratis by the man, which I thought was a really nice touch. Very good. What was your overall rating of the Lanzarote boot sale? Overall rating was good. There was a good variety, including some mixed stalls, which even had fruit and veg, which I thought was quite unusual. Very good. Thank you, Dad. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so that's what Dad picked up. Isn't he cute? Um, I'm now going to show you what I picked up um, and what my mum got as well. So the first thing I got was all from one store. So let me get them all out. So we got four pieces of clothing and she charged us three euros. So super, super cheap. Um, so first thing I got was this little cute orange crop top with a little tie in the front. Thought this was super cute with some denim shorts. I feel like this would be really pretty in the summer. Obviously over here right now, um, but back home, I can just wear that in the summer. I thought that was really, really sweet. Here is the final top. It does feel a bit snug, but I do think it looks really cute. And I quite like the shape of it. Now I've noticed it's got an elastic band holding these bits together, but you can also tie these. Um, so I prefer that would be the alternative, but yeah, I think it's really cute. I love the color again. The next thing I picked up are these little shorts. These are originally a matter and they are in a size 18. So I'm hoping they fit. They have got a stretchy waist. If they are a little bit big, I will wear them as pajama shorts. Um, so I said these were like just under a euro. And um, they've got this cute kind of bandana-y sort of print on them. I just think they're really, really pretty. I love a red. If you've been around here for a while, you know. I like red and I always say it suits me and people laugh at me, but I think it's been really cute, like a white vest top black vest top i just think this is really really cute and yeah for this hot weather i tell you we need some shorts they're really really sweet are uh, the shorts shut my wardrobe do you see all my mess i think these are really cute they actually fit perfectly they are quite short at the front so i don't know if i have to struggle with chub rub with these but they're fine on the back a little bit short but i don't mind that i actually think these are so cute i'm so glad they fit um yeah love these they don't have pockets that is the only thing, but I'll forgive them because they're cute. The next thing I picked up was this beach cover-up. This is originally Chile. I feel like this is a bit like a Chien brand. I've not actually ever seen the website or any advertisement for it, but I know I have seen this brand in charity shops and things before. This is in a double XL, and it's just this kind of star and moon print um little 
cover up i think it's really sweet i've got a black bikini with me and i've actually got a white bikini which i think would look cute as well um and yeah i just thought this was really sweet also i think you could get away with like putting a slip dress underneath this i'm wearing this just actually as a dress and um, i think i'll probably wear it more as a cover up but also i think with a cute, cute bra underneath you could wear this as like a blouse and that would also look really sweet so that is the next thing i picked up here is the little cover up i have put it on top of a checkered bikini which obviously i wouldn't do when I'm wearing it, I'll put it on a black or a white bikini, but I do actually think this looks really, really cute. So I'm very happy with this one. And then I'll show you what my mum got as well, because it was in this little deal. Um, but mum picked up this kind of longer sleeve shirt, because although it's really, really warm in the day, the evenings are getting a little bit cold here. Um, so she picked up this kind of blousy top. It ties up in the front. Um, and it's just really sweet. It's a lovely coral colour in a sort of a linen -y fabric. She would have to probably wear a little vest top underneath because it is slightly see-through. But that was really, really cute. And then the final thing I picked up, this was five euros, but it feels like really nice quality. Um, this is by a brand called Lefties Outerwear. It's in an XL. And it is this kind of mustardy yellow leather jacket. Um, I don't think it's real leather, um, but it feels like really nice quality, as I said. And I sure it's really cute. So this is five euros, so around 450-ish. Um, and yeah, it just feels really nice. I feel like with a nice summer dress, this would look really cute. But also in kind of the autumn winter, I think this is like a nice chunky scarf and some jeans could look really nice. Um, but I think for the summer, I have a sort of a lighter summer dress. This would look really, really sweet. So here is the leather jacket. Again, obviously I wouldn't wear it with this, but I do think this looks really, really cute. And it's just like a nice extra layer. And I love the color. So that is everything I picked up. I really hope you enjoyed today's video of me exploring the world of secondhand in a different country. There is a vintage store that I am hoping to get to at some point, um, which obviously I will show you that as well and hopefully make a whole other video on the vintage store. Um, but this is the boots out. If you are coming to Lanzarote and want to know about it, is this Lanzarote at Caballo? I might be saying that completely, completely wrong. Um, but if you know where the Lanzarote Safaris is, um, that kind of in the centre on the LZ2, it's on there um i almost certain i've got that right it may be wrong it's really near the roundabout with the camels on and you'll know what i mean if you've been to lanzarote and you've been down to like near playa blanca you will know the camel roundabout um and it is just off there um and yeah it was super super fun and nice to explore it wasn't huge i'd say there was probably like 10 to, no probably about 15 stalls and all selling a right mixture of bric-a-brac to clothes to furniture um a whole mix i loved them painted crocs and if they were in my size i would have got them they weren't real crocs but oh my gosh they were absolutely stunning um lots of shoes lots of accessories um and yeah just a right mix and one person spoke english um and the rest of them were spanish people which is really nice um and yeah it was super fun everyone was really friendly everyone was kind of laughing because i was calling dad over to get the money because he brought cash for him whereas i didn't um so i was like i need dad I need the money and they were all laughing at me um but yeah it was super nice and obviously the guy gave dad an extra glass for free which is really really sweet and yeah they were just really nice and obviously it's lovely and warm and in a beautiful setting the only thing is as always with the boots out my shoes are so dirty from like the dust um but yeah it was really great so i'm going to sign off this video here i really hope you enjoyed it if you did don't forget to give it a thumbs up comment if you've ever been to a boot sale or a vintage store or something abroad and subscribe if you're not already and i'll see you in my next one bye